Tessa's is in class, so this is a prime time to hijack her video diary. Because it's, no offense Tessa, but it's pretty much always the same thing. It's either, so like, Elliot just picked up the garbage and he's super cute, but he has a girlfriend, so um, I don't like him. Or it's, we need to find June, cause like, I am, I miss her so much. I mean, don't get me wrong, those things are important. I wanna find June too, and I want Tessa and Elliot to get together as much as anyone, but it's too depressing. And Tess gets real freaky real fast when things get too sad. So, my darling sister, I'm staging an intervention, a video hijacking intervention session. It's a thing. <laughs> some advice and contrary to popular belief I actually have really good advice despite the fact that I got totally wasted at a party and almost ruined a friendship over a boyfriend who was a cheating jerk and dated a cheating jerk in the first place but when you go through a lot of stuff like that you have to learn some things first of all you can't control everything and this is coming from a wildly popular movie star in the Midwest that that doesn't have to do with anything. Actually, I just want to say it was a movie star. <laughs> but seriously, you can't control everything. I couldn't control the fact that Jeremy was cheating on me. I couldn't change him. Could I change the way I reacted to him? Sure. You know, I could have murdered him with a baseball bat and dumped the little bits of his body in the river. But did I? No. I befriended Zoe, didn't I? It wasn't easy, but I made it work. And, I mean, sure, Elliot has a psychotic girlfriend, but can you do anything about it? Duh. And yes, June ran away, but it's not like you're gonna stop looking for her. I mean, it's like that time that you lost that horrifically ugly Cabbage Batch doll. What was her name? Ursula? And <laughs> I cut off all her hair and she looked like the Bride of Frankenstein. <laughs> but mom and dad looked everywhere for her when you lost her. They, they looked everywhere, but you didn't stop looking. All hope was lost, but you kept on looking. And lo and behold, two hours later, you found her in the middle of a bunch of tree branches. And besides the fact that she actually was there, you didn't give up. You found her. The bottom line is, Tessa, you don't give up. You're just... Not a giver-upper, okay? Secondly, you don't have to do this alone. I don't know what happened when you were in school in North Carolina. And I don't know why you had to come home early. You won't talk about it to me, and that's okay. But I do know that you were lonely. And you tried to handle it all by yourself, and you couldn't. And you don't have to. It's like that quote... No man is an island. I don't actually know where that quote is from, but mom hung it on the wall, so it must be true. And you have me, and you have Zoe, and you kind of have Elliot. I don't know what that boy is thinking. I mean, whoever knows what boys are thinking. It's not worth it. It gives me a headache. Thirdly, remember, remember, no matter what, the good times, the bad times, and everything in between, it is always possible to wash and condition your hair. Okay? This is the most important advice I've ever given anyone ever. It is possible to condition your hair and put product, product in it and put makeup on and dress well. Okay? It's not about being the most attractive person in the room or getting all the guys. It's about feeling good about yourself. Okay? I just, I'm not telling you to completely change your appearance with eyeliner and mascara and lip gloss. I just want you to enhance your natural beauty because as cheesy as it sounds, you're beautiful inside and out. I can't.
can't believe I just said that. Okay, so this is a good time to go through Tessa's closet. Some might say I'm nosy or overbearing, but I'm just a concerned sister out to improve her wardrobe one article of clothing at a time. What on God's green earth is this? This is horrible. A, a crime against nature. And this. What are you doing? Just casually going through your closet. Okay then, bye.